Hello guys, hope you are all well. Welcome back to Affinity Racing, another video here on the channel. Uh, something a little bit different from past episodes as this is actually a clip from a live stream. And it is in fact the first live stream on the channel as well. Just getting used to things, just getting things set up in uh, Streamlabs. So please do forgive the uh, mic volume from time to time. Still a little bit to be uh, figured out on the settings uh, on that front. But this was too great a clip not to uh, upload it as a video in its own right because uh, it was a really, really good race um, and two very, very stupid mistakes that uh, no one should be should be making, uh, particularly on this daily race, which was Interlagos, uh, tyre requirements, medium and soft, and uh, you'll just have to see how all of that plays out into this uh, next 20 or so minutes of absolute madness. Hope you enjoy, guys. Cheers. Right, so let's see how we get on with this. Let's see how we get on. So we're going to start with the softs. Um, oh, I didn't even have I didn't have a brake bias even set on those on the practice quality laps with this. Stick with that. Yeah. You go one to the front. Let's be having you. So let's see how we get on. Ah, running a little bit too wide there. Wider than I would want for a start. So we're going to run ragged on the soft, see how far we can get. First time actually racing this car in these tyres, so I'm assuming tyre wear is going to be about the same as the others, what we've already seen on the likes of the Peugeot. Five laps in, you're going to start struggling. And then obviously last in on the mediums. Just going to try and get as close as we can to these guys. To be fair, even in terms of strategy, I'm probably going to pit, if I manage to, if I don't make any mistakes, which for me is a rarity, uh, I'm probably just going to actually pit at the same point that these guys do. Um, just follow their lead. Ooh, nearly. Follow their lead, let them actually just command the race, really. Follow suit. I'll be happy with the podium, to be fair. I'll be happy if I just don't lose any positions. Oh, wow, look at the gap that we've got there. That's mental. I'm assuming there's been a bit of fighting going on behind. So we're going to have just before the. That is not too bad. I think the Aston's just going to have a better run on us there. Or about the same run, to be fair, on the way out of that corner, on the way out of the centre S. I'm going to break a little bit earlier just to play it safe. Maybe just cause a bit of pressure. Oh! Yes! We may well have that. I'm probably going to give him the, the place back when it comes to this corner. Well, not give him the place back, but I'm just not going to fight for it too hard. Oh, and yeah, my phone ringing. Layla, leave us alone. Ah, too late on the upshift. So first, first, uh, the chap first there is starting to pull away a little bit. As is second place, to be fair, the tens are struggling to keep up. Ah, 
just couldn't keep full throttle on there. Moving up into fourth. He's a little bit tighter on his uh, braking points this, this time round. Doesn't quite let us up. It open up for us. I feel like we're getting onto the bat of uh, P1 there now as well. But however close we're getting, I'm definitely getting close at P2. Poorly done. I could add a much tighter. Uh, ah! Just clipped onto the grass there and locked up, locked up on a brake and nearly lost it. Nearly actually went into the back of him there. I'm glad I didn't. That would have ruined both both races. But it has meant he's managed to get away a little bit there, pull away just a little bit bit sooner I think he's actually keeping the gap to uh, he's actually keeping the gap to to p1 about the same there so now it's down to us to close up 2.8 away from the lead 1.1 from the second closing on that gap though I think we must have just got a slightly better exit Definitely closing that gap. Eight tenths, seven tenths. Lovely stuff. Ah, just run a bit wide. I felt like I was happy letting it, happy to let it run wide than actually touch the brakes. as well about to break a bit earlier though just to Ooh. play it safe now he's got back away there out of grasp not quite within a within slipstream range as well I don't think nah and again top end on this attends at we're going to be slightly behind where we make up for or what we make up for on or in my words out is a uh, breaking. Oh, we're going to close the gap there. It's not quite a penalty for him. Both wheels need to be on the uh, have passed the uh, the apex line. He was lucky to hold that there. I can't say I would have managed it. Right. That's better, yeah. Third gear up and around, down into first, nice and tight. Uh, so again, the leader of this race for me, at least, is going to command the command the race. Pretty much, I'm going in whenever he goes. Um, follow suit I think my best bet is just staying staying as close as I can really don't really want to try uh, I could go for the overcut is he going in oh, that makes I want I want to go in now I feel like I want to go in he's going to push one more lap I actually wonder if he's on the the fact that he's still pulling away the way he is I actually think he's possibly on the mediums I think I should have maybe gone in there end of this lap though definitely fellow Britain front definitely struggling as well in that Aston 
tell you what, I can't wait for Aston Martin to be in F1 next year. Very excited about that. Ah. Felt like it was actually only a matter of time before the return when you when you look at it. But. Time gain there for sure. Time lost there for sure. Just not quite managing it. Took it in that corner. Aston squirming ahead there. Right, we're definitely going in. We're into the pits this time round. I have a feeling he's on the mediums. He's going to stay out. We're both on the softs for sure. Oh, you idiot! I press soft. <laughs> I've selected the softs. Ah, no, 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 no. Oh, you idiot! Shit! Oh, look at that, and we're still coming back out as well in second and third. Well, third and fourth. Oh, no. That is absolutely tragic. Well, I'm going to have to make the most of the softs, the fact that I'm on the softs. He's on the mediums. We're going to gain a little bit of time. I'm going to have to run in. You lose eight seconds pit stop in this. So we're going to have to see if we can manage a two-stopper. Which, I mean, to be fair, actually, you can see the difference in speed there already. He is battling, though, so that's made it very easy for us to catch up. Also going to make it very easy, or hard I should say, difficult for us to overtake. Especially if this guy's going to stay in. Stay in the way in the form of traffic. We're going to go for the cutback, switch back. Going to have to take it around the outside. We've done it, we've done it. Third place. Unfortunately on a set of softs that we do not want to be on, but we're going to gain to second place. Yeah, the best, I mean, yeah, the best the thing that we're going to do here yeah, is... Probably, I don't know what, fourth, fifth, given the gap, given the gap, yeah. You have to see where we come back out. I can't believe I've done that. What an absolute idiot. You can see there, the guy who was, was in first coming out of the pits there as well. He's going to remain in front. He's built up a lead, enough of a lead to remain in front. First place is not ours to be had. Unless he's, I don't know. If we can hang about, pick up any scraps of mistakes, but look at that, that is literally the, the, us three, again, still, still maintaining our positions. So we're gonna have to go in at the end of lap 12. Yeah, first position, he, he's on the softs now, so he's started off on the mediums. That's made us two want to push an extra lap while we follow. Ah, and then force us to lose a bit of time on some deteriorating soft tyres. Ah, oh, it's braked way too early there. What am I doing? Ooh. Slight overcorrection there. I think lap 12, 11 or 12, we're going to have to go back in. That's so, so annoying that I can't believe I've made that mistake. <sighs> I mean, if I go in now, eight seconds lost. We're still going to have a gap possibly come out in third still but we're going to be way behind these guys so the best thing that I can do now I think is just push on took in a little bit of slipstream here and there get a bit of a tour try and keep building the gap these two guys are fighting as well which is going to allow me a little bit more time but I don't want to get caught up in that because we need to maintain that gap Ooh, 
that was, well, debatable, shall we say. <laughs> He's pushing my, oh no! I felt a penalty coming my way there. Guy in the Aston, uh, difficult to actually say who, who was at fault there. got the power down a little bit better but look at the gap that's opened up as a result of that or closed I should say not even opened up seven seconds now so if I come out the pits I'm back down into fourth just gonna have to try and keep pushing on pushing on pushing on take a look down the inside we're gonna have that we are gonna have that he's gonna have a much better exit though <laughs> as a result we hold him up that's probably actually to our benefit. Uh, not when he's that close, actually. He's got us straight. He's got us on the straight there. On the straight, straight away. Gonna have to give him the space. Ah, uh, so annoying. I actually think we would have had a decent result out of this race. Um, if I didn't make such a stupid mistake. I mean, the fact that this guy's on the mediums in front of me, or as far as I can remember, he's dropped down onto the mediums. He's doing all right to keep up pace, that's for sure. Ah, oh, six seconds now. I probably should have actually... I would have probably been better off as it now stands, going into the pits a bit earlier. whilst that eight second gap was actually there and then just pushing on as best I can and I might have actually gained a, 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 a bit of time or made up for a bit of time in the fact that these two guys were fighting in front. One second penalty, oh, that is, well, I don't know. Is it harsh? I don't know. I didn't see what he did. I'm gonna have to go to the left of this Lexus. He's, whoa, 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 whoa. He's seen me there for sure. I'm getting a penalty for that. 100% oh, am I getting a penalty. I'm not getting a penalty. Oh! <laughs> I very much doubt I'm gaining an eight second gap though. But it does build up a bit of a buffer between fourth place. That was a little bit mental. I don't really know what was going on there. Oh, it's getting exciting. Oh shit, he's done the same, he's done the same, put the power down too much. Oh you idiot. He's got 0.5 second penalty though. I'm gonna have to pit now on it. That is so annoying. Oh no. Ah shit. Oh no! Oh, well, if I hadn't lost my race, if I hadn't thrown the race away, now I just have. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I knew that was good. I felt myself drifting. Drifting and drifting and drifting. And I could, oh. oh. There's nothing to be made back in this lap. And the, <laughs> and the half second penalty. Please let us serve it here. Oh no. Oh, through force of habit there, I even dropped down a gear as well. Oh. What an absolute numpy. That is so annoying.
so annoying. Fourth place. Had I not have decided to send the car into the barrier, and decide to miss that apex totally, um, I may well have actually. I got fourth place. I may I could have possibly been on the chase for third. I probably would have been. I mean, at best, God, six seconds behind. Difference in braking as well is absolutely insane. Wow, absolutely mental. Absolutely mental. <laughs> I can't believe that. Oh, thrown away the race twice. Ooh. I don't know what's more embarrassing. My pit stop error, putting the wrong tyres on, or Mercedes putting the wrong tyres on. And Valtteri, uh, Valtteri Bottas. That was hilarious. Well, not for George Russell, it wasn't. And I was actually rooting for George as well. I think this I think this tops it actually. Oh. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Well there we go then. <laughs> what a way to throw away your race. Twice. Unbelievable. Oh, and the guy in the Vantage won as well. Wow. That attends, I was actually pretty good around there. I was actually quite impressed with that. Wow, I kind of believe that though. Threw away the race twice. The best I probably would have done was still third, having to do another pit stop. Um, but I don't know, with the way that those two guys were fighting, it's difficult to say because then you might have been involved in some of that. You might have been trying to go for an overtake and get caught up here and there, having to defend as well. So it's difficult to say, but I would have actually been... I would have said competing for second or third. Um, well, third easily, I had third. Competing for second, maybe. Maybe his first was a push, I don't know. Um, so, we'll see. Ah, well, there we are then. If you're watching this on YouTube, please um, like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. Subscribe to the channel. It's always a big help. If you go to the links in the description or you go to affinityracing.co.uk, then um, you'll be able to check out a load of merch um, and all that good stuff, That uh, most of which my girlfriend very kindly uh, designed. Oh, wow. So he's saying that he... Yeah, he did... He, mm, I don't know. Um, probably have a look at the replay, I think. Wow, okay. Interesting. Let's have a quick look at the replay. We'll see what happened. This is where it gets really annoying. Does anybody know a faster way of skimming through the video than this? There has to be. I would have thought that you'd be able to select where you want the video, where you want to go in the video. Good bit of racing going on there. They haven't switched places yet, have they? So 
So I wonder how he got so close there. Was that just breaking distance? Ah, uh, yeah, he runs wide a little bit. Has to stay off the power. Goes for, ooh, he has to come off the power. Goes in for the switch back. Yeah, from what I was seeing, I don't think... I think he struggled to control the, the Aston. Ooh, yeah. <laughs> oh, he's going to... Oh, he's gone for it again. Yeah, so that's how he's got the space. Yeah, he's got to give that back. He's got to give that back. So I was right behind there. At the, I was seeing this. And that's where he went off as well. And that's where I <laughs> went into the back of him. Wow. So as it stands now, the positions that were all in there, I think, is fair enough. Um, um, yeah, the place. So... If he'd gained that place, I think he would have to give it back, for sure. And then I think it's at the end of here. Yeah, this is where... Right, wow. So where's the, where does things get interesting here? So I go for the... For a little look in there. That's all fair enough. Ooh, slight, slight snap. Correct it. Yeah, and he has me on the straight, yeah. I kind of managed to almost outbreak him, but, you know, it's just easier to let it go, really, isn't it, than fighting. So then, where's he managed to catch up to first, then? Oh. Does he go into the back of him? Yeah, he's going to go into the back of him. I don't think that was intentional, not at all, not at all. I would have definitely gave the place back though. You would have to give the place back and then that's where I was fighting to then t take the position. But look at this, yeah, you can see there, he's actually <laughs> he's trying to push me to the wall. I wonder if he's got, I wonder if he's got me confused with him and he's trying to have a little fight back. He then r runs wide and this is where I take first, so, wow. Wow. Yeah, I don't think it was necessarily intentional. But let's have a watch of me. I don't think it was necessarily intentional, but um, I would have definitely given the place back if that was me. Um, and then, yeah, let's just have a look at me managing to totally, totally throw the race away. Just coming into the pits a bit too quick. Slight over... <laughs> Terrific. I mean, it's at this point there that I was like, oh. <laughs> but then I actually opened the car back up <laughs> thinking, well, I wasn't thinking that I had the space because, yeah. <laughs> Oh, no. <laughs> horrific. Absolutely horrific. Yeah, coming out the pits, literally about we bought us. What tyres are these? <laughs> literally me with the soft. And it's at that point that he knew he had ruined his race. Oops. Oh, I didn't want to do that. But that pretty much sums it up. <laughs> Ruining my race. Wow. Hey, dear. Yeah. That's quite the sight, isn't it? Deary me. Anyways, right, well, it's been a blast. Hey guys, thank you so much for watching this video. I really hope you enjoyed it. If you did, make sure you hit that like button, hit subscribe for future videos, future episodes, and more content just like this. And while you're down there, make sure you check out our description for links to our merch store to get hold of awesome t-shirts just like this one. Any orders on the merch store goes a long, long way at supporting channels just like this. I also think the t-shirts look pretty cool, so make sure you grab what you can, and I shall see you in the next episode.